Good morning! I'm up a little early to just get my day started, get Juliana's food ready and stuff because I want to do some holiday shopping and since it's Saturday, <laughs> it's going to be pretty busy so I want to do it in the morning and I told myself my goal is to get my holiday shopping done before, before I go to LA, so before the first week of um, December. So by December 7th, I should be done. I actually wish I would have done it even sooner. Anyway, I just whipped up my smoothie for like the first time in ages. You know, Benji's usually the one doing my smoothies. I hope it's right. I just followed Benji's recipe on Benji Man TV. It's like one of the easiest smoothies ever. Blueberry, banana, and milk. Benji just got back from his run. Holy cow, it what? must be freezing outside. Why? You have frost on Shut your up. beanie. No, I don't. No, it's just... No, it would have melted already. Yeah, but it's like... That's so good to me because it's wet. 10 miles today. Good job, honey. It's possible. Yes. Yeah. It's everywhere, but you're learning. Oh, good job. Now, use your spoon, baby. Here. There you go. Eat. What do you hear, Daddy? <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Come on. Let's eat. Good girl. Mm -mm -mm. Breakfast, so I'm gonna make an omelet today with a little bit of cheese. Got some leftover chicken. I got some of my milk. I'm cooking my omelet a little differently. Uh, I watched a YouTube video by Gordon Ramsay. He's like a celebrity chef if you guys don't know him. And he gave some tips and tricks in the kitchen. And he mentioned when you're cooking eggs or like an omelet, do not salt and pepper them before you cook them. Salt and pepper them afterwards because it changes the texture and maybe the uh, the way it cooks, I don't know. There you go. There's my chicken, a little mayo and some sriracha. I heard the sriracha the factory closed down or something like that. Some rumor. Tell me below on the comments. I would like to know what's going on with sriracha. Um, if you don't know, that's a Asian uh, hot sauce. All right, so I salt and peppered this after I cooked. And let's go look at this. Look at that cheese. Oh yeah, cheese per- oh, it's melty. It's Gruyere cheese. It was just gonna be Juliana and I shopping, but it looks like Daddy wanted to come because he just can't get enough of us. Hi there! What you doing? Where's Hello Kitty? Where are you at? That's right, everybody. We're back here again. I willingly came here though, because I just wanted to hang out with them. I have some stuff to do at the house, but I can do it later. I'm gonna hang out with my ladies today. All right, let's see what kind of weird stuff they got. Hmm. Okay, they got random stuff, of course. Tape. Oh, I need that. A lantern. I need this tape. What? Gift wrapping. Really? Yeah. What is that? It's a nose trimmer. A nose trimmer? But they don't trim. But it's also a you know personal so funny? trimmer, so you could trim Honey, everywhere. nowhere on there do they show him uh, trimming the nose at all. In fact, that kind of looks scary, that little blade that's on the edge of that. Okay, what do you got? What's this, a little one? A digital timer? His and her knife set, is that what that is? Dang, look at this rear view mirror. Look how big this is. <laughs> Juliana likes it. All right. That's underwear, little one. She wants to mimic mommy. She's always grabbing stuff as if she's shopping for it. Let's watch her. Let's watch her. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. She's acting like she has a preference. She's a wannabe shopper. I already know. We'll go over that way, little one. I'm not promising you anything. You're buying that for me for Christmas? Yeah. 
Okay. Not promising nothing. Just okay. um, look. What? Look, but no buy. The heck, a blue penguin or glow pets? That's that's actually kind of cool. She sends me on a job. <laughs> And funny enough, she sends me on a job to buy a gift for a dog. This is the first time in my life I'm buying a gift for somebody else's dog. So she sent me to the pet's aisle. You know the good thing though is, a dog really doesn't care. So this is actually easy for me. Hopefully this cuts down Judy's shopping time. Because I'm actually turning into what I call a retail zombie. Uh, typically you only see men that are retail zombies. Uh, maybe there's some women out there, but a retail zombie is a man that follows a woman that's a shopaholic. I kind of trying to like zone myself out. I'm just paying attention to her actually. That's the only thing keeping me delightful. But what would the doggies want? What do the doggies want? Judy better not complain about what I get for the dogs. Why don't you help me? You point to something, I'm gonna get it. Oh. You pointed to this. I don't know, that's something they would. Ooh, made in the USA. Doug? <laughs> Doug? Okay, this is a good one right here. Yeah, look, I found lumpia for dogs. You know, be a funny trick. At a party, put, after all the lumpia is gone, you put a couple of these on the plate. Yeah. You see who eats it. Especially if you're at a party where there's a whole bunch of drunk people. <laughs> Come on, really? Who wants to spend time baking a bone for their dog? Dear Mama Sal did tell me the, uh, yeah. the leftover pieces from when she juices uh, yeah. makes into treats for Beaner, so maybe she would. <laughs> what makes a retail zombie? Long lines, stark lighting, crazy shoppers, yeah. getting lost, and losing your spouse. Which, by the way, honey? Judy? Honey? I have to call her on the cell phone just to find her. Where's mom? Say, mom? Uh, honey? Mom, if you can relate to what mom, I just described, mom, mom. retail zombie. You kind of just walk around just like a zombie in a zombie movie. I can see one right now. He's walking right in front of me. He's walking right behind his girlfriend or his wife that's totally having fun. He's just... He's right there. He just doesn't know what is going on. See, just following her lead. Silver lining though about all this, and I gotta give it to Judy. Getting Christmas shopping done before Thanksgiving and the crazy Black Friday sales and even uh, going into December. No, I, I, I agree with her. I'd much rather get it done right now and enjoy the holidays, not spend, oh there she is, man, finally. Okay, I'm doing a pretty good job on my list. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight people down on my list. Yes! Okay, now I don't know who's next. Juliana was so patient during our shopping. Thank you, baby. And thanks, Daddy, for helping. So we're gonna check out. We have to go home because Juliana is time. Yeah, she's letting us know. My hands are kind of tired because I was carrying so much stuff and I couldn't find the cart and Benji. But that was really fun. That was like speed shopping. That was fun? <laughs> that was <laughs> serious. I guess because I got help and I didn't have to worry about Juliana. Oh, but go. That's why I, I was it. running around the store carrying everything and I didn't even go to each department to get stuff. But it was it was a huge success, I'm glad. Thank you so much, hun. And Benji got a little treat for himself. I remember these as Turkish delight. You know, in that movie, the, the line, the witch in the wardrobe. Well, I like that those are from Washington. Oh, yeah. We've been giving Juliana milk before we put her down for bed. And she's been doing a great job. She doesn't cry. Um, so it's nice to know she doesn't use a bottle to put herself to sleep. After she finishes this, we're gonna put her into her crib. Holy cow, there's a lot of stuff. I am gonna start gift wrapping. And gift wrapping is so fun to me. It's kind of therapeutic. Even though it's not like I do ribbons or anything, but I just love gift wrapping. Oh, the joy of cloth diapers. I'm gonna do this while watching Dear Mama Sal. This is all I got. <laughs> 
everything else. I need boxes. I forgot a bunch of clothes, so I'm gonna have to hit up like a Target or something. Man, Justin Bieber, he knows how to get them ladies. I'm watching his his Macy's commercial of his new fragrance. And basically he's saying that if you buy my fragrance and you wear it, I will come to you. <laughs> it's actually, it's quite cute. But you know, I actually smelled his first perfume and I thought it smelled really good. I wouldn't mind wearing it. Say, Say hi, hello. mama. Hi, mama hi. Sal. <laughs> she looks so Asian on Skype. It, well, she literally just woke up like five minutes ago. <laughs> okay, here she goes again with my wallet. Can't show my numbers. <laughs> She's like, what are you doing with your hands, mom? <laughs> Juliana's having mom's specialty sinigang. Mommy's having lentil soup, one of my favorites. And then I'm having a huge healthy bowl of this sinigang, which is Filipino stew if you're just subscribing to. It's Jude's life! What? Because we got new subscribers. What do you mean? We got some new subscribers yesterday. From where? On It's Judy's life. Oh. Yeah, so they might not know what it is, even oh. though I've said it like a million times. This is a tamarind based soup that has pork beans bok choy and tomatoes and it's freaking delicious thanks for subscribing and don't worry this mustache won't be here for long <laughs> mom daddy changing your diaper i'm changing her diaper everybody <laughs> let me give you a play-by-play -play about what's going on <laughs> juliana is calm because she got the camera but i'm trying to be quick here because we got a dangerous poo down in the crotch region and yes, it is in her cross region because it sneaks <laughs> up on there. Yeah. Anyways, Juliana, Juliana is continuing to vlog daddy right now. Um, I'm trying to be as quick as possible. Here, we I'll give get her your wipes ready. Yeah, Ooh, thank you. Oh, oh. Yeah, oh, we need we need those wipes pronto. These are the wipes that we use, everybody. Uh, <laughs> uh, fortunately, lately her poops have all been coming out at, very, one, at one piece. Very solid. So very it's, solid. It's ploppable. Too. Ploppable because that's important when you're putting it down the toilet because then you don't have to spray it. Honey, I only need one. I'm getting good at this. Okay. I only need one these mm, days. Just use two just okay. because that's kind of gross. She's always right. She's always right. Mommy is always right. Putting it up. Oh, okay. Juliana wanted to give you a play by play now. Okay. Oh, she's putting it back on daddy. She's putting it on back on daddy. See, you're covering it with your finger. Your little finger, your baby finger. You know what, I was wondering where these good diapers were because they were downstairs. They weren't upstairs. Okay, now I gotta put your leggings on. Just driving and I saw this incredible sunset view. that Juliana got a hold of the chocolates again. She has a thing about going into the pantry and just taking stuff. I'm starting to get super chilly outside. It could feel like a cold air going into the house. Oh, or is it more than just cold air? I don't know, I'm gonna turn on the fireplace, get it nice and cozy in here. Benji. Went back to the co-op. I swear, we're going to the co-op like three times this week, which is crazy. But I guess because we've been eating here at home. Well, actually, no, I did eat at Red Robin the other day, but especially been drinking a lot of milk for my smoothies. And then, of course, Juliana's drinking whole milk now. And speaking of milk, I noticed there's a lot of controversial um, comments on Juliana's milk video. I totally respect everybody's opinion and stuff. Like, that's why I don't comment back on those things. One thing though is that I wish people would respect other people's decision. I don't know, just a lot of people seem kind of angry about it. Back again. Can you believe how much we eat? 
Um, actually, I, I can't believe it. We don't go out to eat a lot, so that's why I have to come back here. And Juliana, she's been really chowing down. Uh, this is all I'm really getting. Some pears, she's been loving those. Bananas, garlic, I'm gonna do roasted garlic. Look, this little herb packet. It's got rosemary, thyme, and something else. I forgot what the other one is. But apples, spinach, green onions, beets, more onions. Yeah, Juliana, if this is how much Juliana eats, I'm kind of scared to see how many how much the twins eat too. Oh, but she's kind of upset because one day he threw he just threw the clothes in the dryer and he didn't look at what he was throwing in the dryer, and one of them was his nice. Sweater, 100% cotton sweater into the dryer and it shrunk and it sucks because this is a really nice sweater that he got at Nordstrom. So he's kind of bummed out about that, but it's pretty much small. I would wear it, but no point in me wearing it now. It's too short, but what a waste. It's been about two hours since we ate and I'm starving. I am so hungry. I'm like literally opening up all the cabinets to see what we have. And uh, I found pot stickers in the freezer. So I'm gonna heat up a few pot stickers. Uh, tonight we're having Chris over, but that's not for another two hours, so I cannot wait. I have to eat ASAP. I just got home. Juliana was hanging out with Auntie and Uncle. And look what I find. We're supposed to have our party night tonight. We're I not know. we're not gonna say. We're not gonna say exactly what kind of party, but it has to do with food and look. I think I found a roly poly in our kitchen, honey. Really? Yeah. Can you see her? Yeah. <laughs> what the heck is that, Juliana? <laughs> She's like, well, since I can't go to bed with my milk. I'm gonna lay on the floor like I am in the bed. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. A little bit of my liquid. Come here! Yeah! <laughs> so I'm trying to have Juliana finish her milk and she's taking forever because she just wants to play. I don't know how you're gonna feel about when it's time to go to nap. Push the button. She's looking for it. It's this one, baby. Wow. That dress is still too big on her. It's 18 months. Back in the kitchen, yo. But in that squash, baby. I love soups. I love how hearty it is. Squashes, pumpkins, gourds are in season, so I'm gonna make it right now. Very simple dish. Uh, won't take very long. We got something special planned tonight, but I'm gonna make this as a side dish. Laura Vitale. Time to pull out Benji's veggies. And I believe he's gonna, I think he's gonna use the blend tech to blend it all together. Oh, that smells good. Roasted veggies and I could smell, what's that, rosemary? Look, a celebrity just came and visited us. What Judy's really excited for is Pizza Party Saturday night! Pizza Party Saturday night! <laughs> we were inspired by the Sakoni Jolies. Mm -hmm. Juliana's first time eating pizza. She loves it. Really? Oh, you want to feed Chris? Honey, you're in my lighting right now. Oh, whoa, whoa, sorry, Mr. Instagram. Like daddy's squash soup? Oh, honey, it's decadent, honey. It's oh, decadent. she's leaning over for it. Oh, honey, it is. Now this one, I cannot have her feed herself because this is just way <coughs> too cray. <laughs> So what I did was for my Instagram, I put a little cream in there, put some chili oil recommended by uh, Laura Vitale, and I put green onions. I just love a little bit of crunch in there. Doesn't even need salt or pepper. I, I use white pepper because it gives it a little bit of a kick, and then uh, I already salted it while it's roasting. So good. 
Mm. So healthy. Carrots, celery, onions, garlic, roasted garlic, butternut squash, olive oil. Okay. Let's see what he thinks about it. Tastes like watered chicken. Not water, but like, <laughs> like liquid chicken. Liquid, there you go, liquid chicken. <laughs> and you know what's funny? I didn't even use chicken stock. I used vegetable stock in this. So you liked it? Yeah. It's got flavor? A lot of flavor just you know this. you know what if you Without like the crazy milk stuff going Yeah on. if you like if you like a little kick I got some hot sauce that works perfectly in it so Here Why are you putting that on your lap? Here You're hoarding your markers There you go we're calling it a night. It's like not even nine o'clock, but that's what our Saturdays are like <laughs> when you have a baby. <laughs> but we're hanging out with nice. Chris oh now. yeah, at least we're hanging out with nice Chris with two eyes. <laughs> so we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye, bye guys. Say bye, little one. When I was like obsessed, obsessed with makeup. I would always look online, see what the new makeup sales are. Let's see, Rite Aid is having 50% off. She wants a really cover girl. Like she's interested. Look, Sicilian orange. That's like a marmalade. What else have they got? Sour cherry. Whoa, these are some unique flavors. And the more fig. That's interesting. Creamed honey. Okay, that sounds really good right now. Juliana's so interested in what daddy's talking about. <laughs>